What's up everybody, this is STN357 for the Second 10 Game Gaming bringing you this next video for cougar spawning with my nice little handy dandy hunting wagon over here in uh, where we at? Great Plains, I'm sorry, Great Plains uh, in West Elizabeth, right? So right now uh, we'll be in the south, just southwest of Blackwater. I have a nice little marker here. Uh, what I'll be doing is, is I'll be getting my hunting wagon over here and uh, the cougar spawn location is... Uh, indicated here by this nice little marker and what we'll be doing is we'll be showing how to use the hunting wagon to identify that the cougar is there now the good thing about uh, Great Plains is you don't really need much of a, a, a sign that the cougar is there it's so wide open that once you once you uh, get to a certain spot and I'll, I'll show you all all these things once you get to a certain spot you'll be able to see the thing spawn so the hunting wagon is kind of mute but I'll show you all how this all goes so kind of uh, go with me as I go through this right quick so we're gonna go over here and try to see if there's a cougar over there already. If it is, I'm gonna kill it first, uh, and then we'll go from there. But if not, we're gonna park this nice little thing over here, and then we'll go from there. So, um, and as always, uh, like the video, subscribe, share with your buddies, and hopefully, uh, throughout this video, we can uh, we can get something going that you all can use and um, take back with you and make this hunting for cougar stuff a whole lot easier. So what I'm going to do right now is um, I'm going to identify a couple things, right? So this nice little marker that I have right here is right where the cougar spawns. That's where, that's where he sleeps at. So what I'm doing is I'm taking my hunting wagon. I'm placing it right here uh, with uh, hoping that when the cougar spawns here, when the cougar spawns in this location, with my wagon sitting right there, I'll get a nice little blood splash, danger, oh snap, there's a cougar right there on my screen kind of thing going. So I'm going to run to this uh, spot that I've identified as uh, the distance that I need to be far back to watch it spawn. And it's right in this little pinch point. If you all kind of look at the map a little bit right here, uh, this nice little pinch point of uh, identified that is the spot where uh, the cougar spawns at. So sometimes it takes a little bit of running back and forth as you all seen from my other videos of how this all works. So I'm going to be sitting right in this little this little pinch spot right here. This, this spot and this spot in between here. I'll be running in circles in this little area right here hoping to get this thing to spawn. There we go. There's a threat indicator right there. So you see the threat indicator. You see the cougar highlighted right there on the left. And you see the thing right there. So that's the first time it's worked. Thank goodness. Because then it had me looking like a damn crazed fool over here. Like I don't know what I'm talking about. Like I haven't done this before. But I mean it's a, it's a learning process. But, so easy day right. You come over here. Put the cougar down. Sometimes I prefer to shoot it from the rock. But you all can shoot it however the hell you want. Uh, but yeah so... Uh, we're in business. It, it worked. It worked this time. I don't know why. It, why it didn't work the first time when we did it. Uh, and then, as you can see, I was in the same location that I told you that I usually hover around when it spawns. So, uh, one thing I've been talking about before in the first video I did was the timing of it. So I put the uh, cougar in at 2:09 inside game time. So what I'm what I'm banking on and what I'm what I'm hoping to see here is I'm hoping to see. Uh, within maybe an hour so at the 309 mark or at the no later than 330 mark another cougar be spawned up there uh, so we'll see hopefully this this pays some dividends over here so just bear with me All right, so now we're looking at the time before we head over here to our spot. It says 2.40 right now. So I'm going to peruse over here for a little bit in hopes to see that, see if it's a timing thing. I thought I stole the, the cougar if it takes one in-game hour for another one to appear. So just kind of bear with me as I look at the time under here. And this is kind of me experimenting a little bit. So again, you all are kind of watching me in my little my little process and how I do things and you know ain't really nothing too crazy but this is kind of my thing this is what I this is what I do I like to break down things so it's uh 
smallest form and find out why it works opposed to just doing it. I want to know why the game spawns the Coopers. I want to know how how freaking it does it and all that other kind of stuff. So here we go. Uh, we're just coming up on this uh this quarter this in game hour mark. Uh, it's at 3:04 now. Uh, we're in a spot that I, I've uh, identified that will spawn the Cougars. So we're gonna sit here. It's 3:09 now. Look at that Cougar spawn just right there. You see that threat indicator on the map? That's what I'm talking about right there. So one one in-game hour so far is the uh, the legend right now for uh, Cougar spawn. So if you feel yourself not being able to get one, this has been proven more than once by me. Uh, it'll take one in-game hour after you stow the cougar away. So I, I started the first one, killed it at, uh, stowed it away at 209. The next one was ready at 309. Uh, and I'll try to see if I can highlight that some way, some fashion, uh, for you all to see this. So yeah, so it's pretty easy. I'm not going to keep going on. I'm going to try to see if I can get one more just so we can, uh, we can show you all. Um, actually, shit, I think I might be good. I don't know what y'all think. I think we're good. I think we might be good.